New tonight, the uh, Northeast Georgia County is now dealing with that question as this landfill runs out of so much room. It's a lot faster than they projected. And as 11 Alive's Doug Richards report, it's a position other counties may find themselves in. Folks here in Habersham County have a garbage emergency on their hands with no easy solution. A decade ago, engineers estimated that the Habersham County landfill would fill the waste disposal needs of the populace until 2072, 50 more years. But then the county's garbage hauls got bigger and bigger. 10 years ago, we were taking approximately 50 tons a day. Now, some days we're taking 150 tons a day. County Commission Chairman Bruce Palmer says now the landfill could reach capacity in as few as two years. Habersham County contracts for curbside garbage pickup. The county has grown faster than many rural counties in Georgia, but not as fast as Georgia as a whole, according to census data. When the county built this landfill, residents expected it to last a lifetime. The, the citizens here, they nearly had a heart attack, all of them, when they put this landfill here, and I don't see them ever wanting another, another one. Lori Church says the county has to upgrade its recycling program, though she says curbside recycling is too costly for a county this rural. She suspects residents will want to find a way to ship refuse elsewhere when this landfill reaches capacity. I mean, they, you know, they may change their mind when they see mm -hmm. what it's going to cost to ship it out of county. Which puts this county in a spot that will challenge local governments across Georgia for decades. How to manage trash and the expectations of those creating it. They want the service, but sometimes it's uh, it's hard to convince them what the service cost. And and popular support for garbage is lacking. Palmer says even if Habersham County finds a new landfill site, it'll take up to a decade to buy and permit and prepare the property. And he's afraid this landfill will fill up long before then. Near Clarksville, Doug Richards, 11 Alive News.